So, we're, it's Thanksgiving time, and a couple of months ago, a story broke about Brax Candy was gonna release a bag of candy called Turkey Dinner Candy Corn. So, we thought it would be cool to do a little taste test, basically so you don't have to. Uh, so, this is what it looks like. This is your Brax Turkey Dinner Candy Corn. And we have Brendan Wayne. What's up? John Kazar and Dave Cullen. They are our brave taste testers for today. Let me break down the flavors for you. So we have, uh, red here is cranberry sauce. Then we have sweet potato pie, ginger glazed carrots, green beans, stuffing, and then the thing you can't have enough of on Thanksgiving is your turkey, your roasted turkey. So are you guys ready? Much as I'll ever be. Yeah. All right, yep. so we're gonna start at the bottom. We're gonna start with your cranberry sauce. Cranberry sauce. So go ahead and let's taste the cranberry sauce. And we're looking for authentic taste. Does it actually taste like cranberry sauce? What do we think, Dave? Does it taste like cranberry sauce? It's a little sweet. A little sweet. It's okay. a little too 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 sweet for for cranberry sauce. Okay, I think. John, what do you think? No. no, no. I mean more no than yes for sure. No. Okay. Brian? Yeah, for sure, no. It's a little <laughs> sweet with a bitter taste. Yeah. Okay, so not really authentic cranberry sauce. It was yeah. a good piece of candy corn, though, right? <laughs> <laughs> Dave is not a fan of any form of candy corn. Not a fan of candy so corn. So he's really, he's really powering through this. I totally. have a feeling that's going to be the best one, but that's just my prediction, so... <laughs> okay, go. let's move on. We're going to go to sweet potato pie. Let's give it a shot. Sweet potato pie. Give it a shot. Well, here we go. Sweet potato pie candy corn. Mmm. Wow, that was... Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, Brendan, Brendan uh, what, do you, what do we think? What are we thinking? It was delicious. <laughs> I didn't taste anything about sweet or potato in that. <laughs> okay. All right. All right, John. I give it a thumbs, double thumbs up. It tastes like sweet potato pie. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's got it's got the cinnamon that you'd find in like a sweet potato pie. I can taste like the the yammy sweet potato ness of it. Yeah. So I would well, I would say that, that that's it, more of a success. It tasted more like yams to me than sweet Ooh, potato. Okay. I can hear. I can see that. Too. I, I can it. taste yeah. that too. <laughs> okay. All right. Moving on. We're gonna go on to the ginger glazed carrots. Ooh. Let's give that a shot. Okay. Oh yeah. oh yeah, yeah. Brendan's loving this one. I like right. it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, Dave. I mean, it tastes like ginger. Carrots. <laughs> Carrots. <laughs> tastes like corn. Ooh, I'm not gonna lie to you. When you start to really get into this one, it, it's it's tough. Is that like ginger? There's yeah, the ginger. Yeah. Brendan, you you were liking this one. Yeah, it's my favorite so far. I don't know really what it was supposed to taste like. What was it again? Ginger glazed carrots. Hmm. I definitely tasted the carrots. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. So we're gonna move on. The green bean is next. This it's one better be dreading. casserole form inside. <laughs> <laughs> Does it actually taste like green beans? Oh, John! Again, when you get right, right, right there, right there. You got once you get through the, the outside, you get in. It's like you, you get that flavor. A little bit. A little yeah. bit. A little yeah. bit. John, what do you think? What do you think? Just as I maybe I put this in my mind, but just as I predicted, it's my least favorite so far. <laughs> you never liked your dreams. <laughs> Come on, Dave, eat your greens. Okay, I so, love greens. Okay. Why do you want to go grab the next one just to get the flavor out okay, of it? Okay, so now we're moving on to stuffing. Let's give the stuffing a try. Let's see if this actually tastes like Thanksgiving stuffing. Well, I would know because that's my usually my favorite side dish during Thanksgiving. So, Dave, what did you think of the stuffing? Um, you know, it was in interesting, you know, when, when you have stuffing, you get that like brothy, bready taste that kind of goes up and you kind of smell it too. And yeah, it, it, it definitely did, did that. So I would say it's a successful attempt. John. Absolutely. And again, stuffing is my favorite side dish on Thanksgiving. It, it accomplished the taste for the most part. Yeah, I love stuffing. Um, not a real big fan of that, though. If that tasted like your stuffing, I'm not going <laughs> to be having it. More like hash at this point. Yeah. I'm not a fan of that either. <laughs> okay, here it is. We are at the, we are at the end. I'm going to try this one with you. It oh, is how the, nice of you to join us, man. <laughs> turkey candy corn. Let's give it a shot. Whoa, powerful right off the bat. Okay. Whoa. All right. This tastes better than the actual turkey itself. Ah. <laughs> the only reason is because it's not as dry as turkey would be, but yeah, there, that's a big part of it. 
Mm. What else am I tasting in there? All right, John, it's, what, what do you think? What do you think? It's good. It doesn't match its, you know, what it's supposed to as well as the other ones do. But it's good. I mean, this is this is interesting candy corn. I'm not gonna lie. What do you think, Brendan? It was pretty good. Um, yeah. I, you know, not a real big fan of turkey. I'd rather have ham. But you know, for turkey, it was pretty good. Dave. <laughs> <laughs> so imagine you take a little ball of gravy, and then you crystallize it and turn it into the shape of candy corn, and add a whole lot of sugar. That's what I think this this was. So technically, because you've got that taste in, in there, I'd say it was a successful attempt. So I tried it too, and I think it tastes like turkey broth. Yeah. yeah there we go, but not yeah, turkey like itself. Turkey broth. It's gonna be hard for this thing to kind of actually replicate turkey yeah. itself. That's so they probably they didn't go that route. They said, we're like, go this wasn't the... dry. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't dry. <laughs> Definitely was not dry. No, no. Okay, all right, so. All right, dump the whole bag out, here we go. Out of, <laughs> well, out of all the flavors, favorite, Brendan. Uh, one authentic, one that tasted, you think tasted the most like that it was supposed to. It was either the one before the last. Um, was the stuffing? The stuffing or the third one, the second one that we tried. That was, was uh, the sweet, sweet potato pie. Yeah, that one was pretty good. Okay. No, John? sweet potato pie is my number one for sure as far as being like it's supposed to. Okay, worst, yeah. Brennan, worst one. Oh, that doesn't taste like what it should have. Oh, definitely the cranberry. Yeah, okay. that was terrible. <laughs> it didn't John. really taste like cranberry sauce, but the, to me, the green beans, I mean, I know what they were trying to do. They know that people don't love green beans. They don't usually taste good to a lot of people. They did that, but it doesn't even taste like green beans. So they just made something taste awful. <laughs> Dave? Dave, <laughs> best and worst. Start with the worst. Uh, worst, I would say it's a tie between the green beans and the cranberry sauce. Um, best, or at least most successful, I would say is the sweet potato pie. But if you think about it, it's candy. So yes. the sweet potato pie should be something should that they should be able to It already has do. that working for it. I right? will say the snozberries do taste like snozberries. So Fantastic. there you go. All right, so there you go. So go pick up a bag of your Brax turkey dinner candy corn or don't. I mean, we've tried <laughs> so, uh, Shout out Brax. <laughs> get them if you want to. You can find them at your local store and have a happy Thanksgiving.